Good morning dear students. Today we shall be learning about addition and subtraction in fractions. So I am beginning with addition, addition of mixed fractions. So as uh, I have told you earlier in comparison also, what we have to do? We have to convert the mixed uh, fraction to improper fraction first. Then we have to add. Uh, we have to find the LCM of the uh, denominators, uh, make it like fractions and then add. Here if I convert it to improper fraction 10 into 2 plus 1. So the denominator same denominator I am going to write 2 into uh, 10 plus 1 the second for the second fraction 5 the same denominator i am writing 5 into 3 plus 4 5 into 3 plus 4 that is 5 into 3 plus 4 so it is equal to 10 10 into 2 is 20 plus 1 is 21 plus 5 5 into 3 is 15 plus 4 that is 19 so now we have to convert these two different denominators to like uh, uh, numbers. Uh, so for that we have to um, find the LCM of 10. Uh, it is 5. Again if I divide by 5 it is 1. And for this 5 if I divide by 5 it is 1. Therefore 10 is equal to 2 into 5 and 5 is equal to 5 into 1 and so what is the LCM LCM is nothing but the common factors that is 5 into um, here we have extra common factor 2 so it is equal to 10 so what we have to do we have to make this 2 10 it is already 10 we have to make it to the LCM uh, it is equal to the LCM we have to make 10 into if I want to make 10 equal to 10 then we have to multiply by 1 uh, in comparison I have uh, ascending order and descend descending order I have mentioned so for 21 as it is multiplied by 1 it will be also multiplied by 1 plus 5 how can we make 5 10 if we multiply it by 2 19 into 2 the same number we have to multiply so it is 10 21 into 1 is 21 plus 5 into 2 is 10 19 into 2 is 38 so I have told you earlier if both the denominators are same what was the rule just write one denominator for both 21 and 38 if you add it is um, 59 by 10 so if 59 by uh, 10 you have this is improper fraction you convert it to like fraction uh, sorry uh, mixed fraction it is equal to 5 and 9 by 10 this way you have to um, do for subtraction what you have to do you just change the sign I will explain that in one example in my next um, explanation I have three numbers uh, sorry fractions 3 by 11 2 by 5 and 4 by 55 what I have to do, uh, I have to find the LCM of these three numbers, uh, that the denominators and uh, find the sum. Because all the three fractions are unlike fraction because their denominators are different. We have to make the denominators uh, same to convert it to like fraction we what we have to do we have to find the LCM of the denominators and then convert it to uh, like fraction 
I have done it uh, in comparison also in ascending order descending order also but um, for your understanding I am repeating this again you can see that the LCM of 11 5 and 55 is uh, what you have to find the um, factors prime factors uh, so it is 11 equal to 11 into 1 for 5 it is 5 into 1 for 55 first we divide by 5 we get 11 then 11 we get 1 therefore 11 is equal to 11 into 1 5 is equal to 5 into 1 55 is equal to 5 into 11 what is the LCM then therefore the LCM is equal to what uh, we have 11 1 11 here and 1 11 here so I am writing 1 11 for both 5 here and 5 here so again I am writing 1 5 for both the 5's so it is 55 that means we have to make 11 uh, 55 plus 5 this also 55 plus 55 is already there so no need to write anything you just uh, write the same fraction so to make 11 uh, 55 what we have to do we have to multiply it by 5 as I have multiplied the denominator by 5 numerator also I should multiply by 5 the same way 5 into 11 is 55 so 2 into 11 same number uh, denominator and numerator I have to multiply so 11 into 5 is 55 15 55 22 plus 4 by 55 all the denominators are same I am writing 1 for the 3 then 15 plus 22 plus 4 which is equal to uh, 41 by 55 uh, this should be the answer mm, so you go through the book and you check the answer this way you have to do in case of uh, subtraction you have to change the uh, sign uh, subtraction is uh, can be done between uh, which two num uh, fractions only so between the two fractions there will be the sign uh, subtraction sign what you have to do in place of plus you have to subtract uh, that is the basic uh, idea I'll do one uh, sum to explain that So here we are doing subtraction Sub subtraction from a whole number uh, this is not having any uh, fractional part so what actually it is a whole number can be represented as a fractional in the denominator it is one if it is one and the numerator part is the number itself it is nothing but this number only so for every whole number suppose you are writing 100 minus uh, 3 by 4 so this is a whole number it doesn't have any fractional part so it means it is having 1 as denominator and 100 as numerator for this we are having ten, uh, 10 numerator and 1 denominator so what will be the um, LCM of 1 and 7 so 1 and 7 LCM is nothing but 1 into 7 that is equal to 7 um, I write here LCM equal to 1 into 7 that is equal to 7 
I have to write ten um, sorry one ten into I have to make it seven as it is LCM is seven so it is seven equal uh, minus seven six seven is same so no need to do anything seven ten into seven is seventy minus six by seven that is seven and seven i am writing one for both seventy minus six which is equal to sixty four by seven if i divide sixty four by seven it is nine times it is sixty three one that is this nine is my quotient quotient i am writing here uh, the denominator i am writing the divisor part and remain remainder is the numerator part so nine is the quotient seven is the divisor and r that is one is the numerator of the um, fraction so this way you have to do if uh, any number is a whole number this whole number may be here also um, suppose 6 by 7 minus 1 something like that so you have to just uh, convert it to uh, convert the whole number into fraction by putting 1 at the place of denominator just remember that the next important topic is multiplication of fractions so find the product of 1 by 5 and 4 for multiplication what we have to do that is uh, product of the numerators divided by product of denominator so it is the denominator will be the product of the denominators and uh, the numerator will be the product of the numerator after the multiplication so here i have 1 by 5 into 4 4 i can write it as 4 by 1 as 4 is a whole number i have mentioned earlier uh, that uh, in uh, for every whole number the denominator is 1 so i am writing the one here now uh, for multiplication what we have to do product of the denominators that means the denominators are five and one five into one there is no question of lcm remember that because i have seen many uh, students find the lcm to multiplication also LCM is needed for only sum and uh, subtraction, not for multiplication and division. I am repeating, LCM is required for plus and minus, not for multiplication and division. It is never needed. So, remember this here you don't have to find the lcm just multiply the denominators in the numerators one and four multiply the two numbers so it is equal to five into one is five one into four is four that is after uh, multiplication of one by five and four the product is four by five I am taking another example question uh, two and a half into 15 suppose it will be you have to convert it to improper fraction you cannot uh, multiply directly so 2 into 2 plus 1 uh, the denominator is 2 this 2 will come down 2 to the 4 2 into 2 plus 1 into 15 and this is as this is a whole number there will be 1 uh, as denominator that is 2 into 2 plus 1 is 5 to 15 
1 so multiply the numerator with numerator 5 into 15 2 into 1 that is equal to 7 in, uh, 5 into 15 is 75 by 2 so it is improper fraction you convert it to mixed fraction 75 you have to divide by 2 that is 3 6 1 5 will come down that is 7 14 1 will be remainder there therefore it is 37 1 and half you do the sum properly in your copy uh, as there is less space i have just give you i have just given you the hint so the answer is 37 and half after multiplication suppose we have uh, three fractions we have to find the product 2 by 3 into 3 by 4 into 3 by 5 so for that I have to multiply the numerators 3 into uh, 2 into 3 into 3 suppose and product of the denominators 3 into 4 into 5 so 3 into 4 is 12 12 into 5 is 60 2 into 3 is 6 3 into 3 is uh, sorry 6 into 3 is uh, 18 so we got what we have got 18 by 60 now what we have to do we have one more steps to uh, do we have to uh, convert it to lowest term for that I have uh, done earlier what you have to do find the factors it is 30 if you divide 60 by 2 you get 30 again you divide uh, 30 by 2 you get 15 3 5 5 and 1 for 18 divide by 2 it is 9 again divide by 3 it is 3 3 1 so in place of 60 I shall write the product of the factors that is 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 for 18 in place of 18 2 into 3 into <coughs> 3 so 1 2 and 1 2 will be cancelled out this 3 and this 3 will be cancelled out what is the remaining uh, factors we have 3 it as numerator and in denominator it is 2 into 5 so it is 3 2 into 5 is 10 so the product of these 3 um, factors is 3 by 10 this way you have to uh, do the calculation